Daisy's up, Blackberry. Between us and the Ephraphrens, we're packed in like thorns in a bramble patch. We need more room. Well, well, I know that, but there's no point wearing out your paws. When I'm busy, I don't have time to think about Campion. I think Campion's spirit is still here. Still with us. His spirit is no use to me. Well, maybe it's more than that. Maybe... maybe he's still alive. We saw him die. I know. And I can't explain it. It's just a feeling that won't leave me alone. My heart's already <sighs> broken, Fiver. I don't need false hope making it worse. <sighs> oh, cast your eyes on that, Pipkin. Oh. These Ephrafans act like they still expect Woundwort to drop on them any minute. Hey. What? <gasps> we'll have that carrot. Not Anger Farms down that way. Go get your own. I said we'll have that one. I'll deal with this. Yeah. It's just a carrot. We can get more. Do as you're told, Pipkin. Why don't you ugly lumps just try and take the carrot? Sire. You don't have to do that here. You're not a slave anymore. Poor Ephraim and bunnies don't know up from down. They've had a lifetime of being told what to do. It's all they know. And there are still a lot of them wandering lost out there. It's up to you two to find them. Oof. Haven't we got enough riffraff round here already? Mm. No offence. We won the war, Hannah. It's our duty to help the survivors. Get moving. Fine. You're the boss. OK. Yeah! Not again. Oh, for goodness sake. Ow! That's enough. The next nitwit picking a fight will be one very sorry rabbit. Now hop it. I'd have had them in another minute. No more fighting, Bigwig. I mean it. Tell them that. I've had it up to my ears with Ephrafans. A bunch of lazy wastes of space they are. No offence. <sighs> offence taken. <sighs> That's enough. Bigwig, go. Take out a patrol or something. Hmm. Sorry, Hazel. Woundwart's rule is like a shadow on us. I know. But it's up to you to lead the way, Moss. I don't want to be a leader. Neither did I. You don't always have a choice. Hmm. I found it over by the rose thicket. A lovely patch of tender young dandelions, and I thought... Hmm. I wish you lot were quick bowing. You don't need permission to go on Silflay. Go any old time you want. Driving me round the twist, this bunch. Huh? Well? Oh, well, what? Do you want to go and nibble some dandelion leaves with me? <laughs> that back clawing sneak. Excuse me, Clover. Of course. <laughs> We might have won the Battle of Ephraim without me, <laughs> but it would have been a near thing. Heather, um, I've got a yen for some fresh dandelion sprouts. How about you? Why not? <laughs> Steal my dough, would you? You've had it, chum. Does my heart good to see that place in ruins? Good riddance from what? 
and ugly for vain. So, where do Ephraim runaways go to hide? Let's try the woods. Run along, Pitkin. Do as you're told, Pitkin. Hmm. Oh. Thought it was snowing for a minute there. <laughs> Mad at the dandelions, are we, Pipkin? Oh, it's everything, Drumlin. The warren's overcrowded. Everyone's snapping at each other. Hmm. Hmm. You know, there's always someone with worries bigger than yours. Over there, for instance. What does it mean? They're waiting for something to die, if I know my crows. <gasps> Maybe it's not too late to help. Now that's the Pipkin I know. Hey, get away! I said clear up! Shoot, leave it alone! <gasps> Captain Campion! <sighs> That's good. Thank you. Go on, Pipkin. Tell me what happened after the attack on Ephrafa began. Well, lightning came from the sky. Sap! The twisted tree split and caught fire. as if the earth just swallowed it. It was horrible, Captain Campion. And General Woundward. What happened to him? <laughs> the Black Rabbit took him. And he'll take you too. If you don't come back to Watership Down, you're very ill. This is where I belong. Away from everyone. But everyone's so sad thinking you're, um, dead and all. I betrayed my chief. Now he's gone and my warren is in ruins. I'm not fit to live with honorable rabbits. But you saved Wardship Down. You're a hero. Promise me, Pipkin. No one wants to know I'm alive. Promise. Even Blackberry? Her heart's broken because she thinks you're gone. Especially Blackberry. I don't want anybody's help. Promise. You'll get my help, whether you like it or not. I promise. Something pretty big scares at Heron. Maybe we should all go pretty soon. Like I say, if you want a new life, Hazel Ra will help you. Understand? Oh, please. That would be so grand. Fine, then. Follow the path of the setting sun till you get to Nuthanger Farm. Mm. Wait outside the wall and someone will lead you to Watership Down. Mm. Got that? The worst is over, rabbits. Just be careful! <laughs> I will rebuild my empire, and you two will be my first subjects. Kneel before wound wart. No! Never again! <laughs> Renew your allegiance to me, and I'll help you out of here. Never! Never! And the Black Rabbit of Inlay can have you. Oh, 
Ow! You're getting to be more scars than skin, Bigwig. What's that you're putting on me? Chewed burdock. It'll keep the wound from going bad. What happened? As you suggested, Hazel, I went on solo patrol and found him. One of your bunch, Moss. Thought he'd wander off and see the sights. Saw a weasel instead. Hmm. <laughs> Captain Moss, I want to go back. Back to Africa and the way things used to be. No, you don't. You're just feeling a bit lost. There were no Elior in Africa. Moonwort drove them off. And this place, they just do as they please. They want to be told what to do. I saw Heather first, and she likes me best. Well, there you go with that wild imagination of yours again. Let's settle this once and for all. A challenge. <laughs> right then. Whoever brings back the best flayra from Nuthanger Farm wins. Then you might as well pack it up now, sick ears. You haven't got a fly's chance in a frog pot, do Oh, mother! You did that on purpose, twit. Still battling it out for your attention, I see. Do you have a preference? Whichever is stronger. Love doesn't enter into it, then? There was no room for love in Ephrafa. There is in Watership Down. Hello, Moss. How are you getting on then? Hello, Heather. Um, not so well, really. Got a bit of thinking to do. Hmm. Two heads are better than one. I done enough? I'm tired of war and fear and loss. There is no rest for you yet, Campion. You must fight him. I can't. You will not fight alone, but fight you must. Campion! Can you hear me? I've brought healing herbs. Blackberry told me how to use them. Here, chew this. It'll bring down your fever. It's elm bark. I said I didn't want any help. I don't care. You've got to live, Campion. You've got to fight. Hmm. All right, Pipkin. I'll fight. Good. <laughs> Beat that, Hobbit! Challenge, Hawkbit, and lose, Dandelion, my old chum. Well, if that's how you're going to play the game, old chum, I'll just do you one better. Oh, I wouldn't. The dog's loose. Hmm. Silly twit. Without my turnips! <laughs> 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 
Never mind the turnip! Oh, well, isn't this just lovely? Well, how do you suppose I'm going to get you out of there? Right then, off you go. There's nothing to stop you claiming Heather now, is there? <gasps> That's it, your idea, is it? Pummel me with stones? I thought if I dropped enough of them in the well, they'd fill it up and you could climb out. Hang on! The water rose a bit. Maybe you are onto something. Keep them coming. Blackberry! I don't know if those Ephraphans will ever fit in, Hazel. I've been thinking the same thing, Hazel. I need to talk to everyone. I'll arrange it. We of Ephrapha and you of Watership Down survived the tragedy of war. The trail ahead is free and open. Hazel freed us and gave us sanctuary. Now, it's time we made our own future. In a new Warren. In a new world. No one will ever rule us again. We are all equal. From now on, we will decide together. I want a new life, far away from memories of wound, wart and war. I say we go. Who's with me? Wait! I'm not your chief! You just said we'd decide together, Moss. We've decided. Thank you. If you want me, then I accept. Oh, it doesn't seem right. Two friends at each other's throats over a doe, does it? I mean, there are lots of does in the world, but not all that many friends. Here he comes. Watch out. <laughs> of course, friends can be an awful trial too, can't they? Dandelion. Oh, no, you don't. You're not pulling this on me. If heaven's got the rotten taste to pick you, you have my blessing. Same, same goes for you. Friends, whether you like it or not. Well, Fiverr, you're the one with the far sight. What do you see in our future? Sorry, Moss. My vision doesn't work like that. I'll tell you what I see then. Joy and sadness, love and loss, despair and hope. Life, Moss, lived as it comes. Can't ask for more than that. Run well and safely, all of you. What's going on? Where were they going? Off to find a new home. Hmm. And what about Heather? 
I'm sure she and Moss will be very happy together. <laughs> New tomorrows for them and peace for us. Campion gave us so much. You're not coming back to Watership Down with me, are you, Campion? No, not yet. When? When I've done what I must do. And you won't tell me what that is? I'm not sure I know myself. Pipkin, you saved my life. Thank you. And you saved us all, Campion. Wherever you go, whatever you do, you'll never be forgotten. <laughs>